What? You want to do another TikTok trend? <laughs> Babe, seriously. I already told you this kind of content doesn't really work with my image on my channel. Well, even if it's for your channel, you know, you create nice jewelry pieces. I just don't think that following stupid trends is going to get you more subscribers. I know that having me in some of your videos helps your visibility to grow, but are you sure? Especially after the Charlie incident? <sighs> okay, fine. Uh, what's the trend this time? A hear me out cake? What is that? Oh, okay, so it's just where we take turns and, what, well, you want me to pick a group of girls I find attractive? <laughs> you know, I'm really surprised you want to know that. All right, um, you know, I'm a red-blooded American. I've got fantasies and things that I like, but are you really sure you want to play this game with me, babe? Well, you know, maybe you are easily jealous. You remember the other day we were watching Wonder Woman and you kept putting your hand over my eyes because you said I could see her thighs? Yeah, so I'm just saying I don't know if it's a good idea. Sure, we can still do it, but you have to promise you won't complain. Oh, come on. <laughs> I won't be jealous over the guys you pick. I'm not like that. I have faith in our relationship. Even if you have fantasies about other men, <laughs> I know I'm not in danger. And you know it's not as if anything would really happen anyway. Right? Well, there you go. It's just a hypothetical game, so I'll be able to handle it. How many do I have to choose? At least five. That's kind of a lot, but okay. I'm pretty sure I can find five great matches. So how much time do we have before you record? An hour? Okay. I can make that work. Yeah, it's nice to be here again. It's been a while. I do hope that uh, no one's disappointed by the fact that we're still together. <laughs> After what happened last time, which I apologized for. Okay, babe, I see you're holding several uh, of yours close to the chest here. Are those going to be the potential partners? I mean, <laughs> that's what they are in the end, right? <sighs> that's semantics. Let's get started then. You go first. Ryan Reynolds! Completely relatable, especially after the last Deadpool movie. I'm just surprised he didn't lead off with Hugh Jackman. <laughs> that was your second choice? Okay, alright, I get it. That makes sense. Now it's my turn. Hear me out. Mommy Himiko from Honkai Star Rail. Oh, you know how obsessed I was when I got started in that game. Yes, Mommy. <laughs> Have you seen her... Uh, attributes? You can't blame me for calling her that. Don't start getting jealous. She doesn't even exist. Okay. Who is your next choice? Shikimaru from Boruto. Oh, Kidoki. 
Yeah. Oh no, I, I I get it. I mean, okay. I can't remember how many times you've called me lazy, and here's a guy that spends his entire day taking naps. Well, I'm far from being as smart as he is, but still. You're right. He is less lazy as an adult, but that's probably because his wife is terrifying. <laughs> okay. Hear me out. Melanie. Okay, okay, I, I said hear me out. Hear me out. I know it's your older sister, but babe, it's not my fault if beauty is in your genes. Don't look at me like that. I don't have feelings for your sister. Okay? I mean, okay, she is pretty. But uh, what made me fall in love with you is your personality and your good heart. But you can't deny the fact that she wears bigger bras. They're fake? For real? I, I, I didn't know. They, they just really, really look real. Oh, there you go. There's proof that I just don't look at them that much. Or else I would have guessed they're fake. Not that it would matter to me anyway. All I'm saying is, if it were her, I wouldn't have to, you know, use a pillow to take a nap. They're just kind of part of her package. You're not that flat. You, you just look like cherries. And, and that's cute. Babe, I swear I love you just the way you are. And <laughs> you guys are not even comparable. You said you wouldn't be jealous. This, this is just a stupid game. Let's just let's just move on. Let's move on. Ayazawa. Um, all right, it's relatable. Yeah, he's a teacher. He's strong. He has dark hair and cool eyes. He's a sigma who barely talks and loves cats. I get it. Hey, I look Sigma too. Sometimes I wear a leather jacket. You love it. Right? See? I can be like him if I wanted to. Anyway. Uh, hear me out. Maria. Babe, don't look at me like that again. I mean, you know I used to have a thing for cake? Yes, I said used to, babe. I, I have accepted my fate when I fell in love with you. Hey, I'm with you, so I'm not looking at other women that way anymore. It's just, you know, I, I took this game seriously. That's all. <laughs> Try to imagine circumstances where I would be attracted to other women. It's you know, part of the trend, right? Or did I get it wrong? I, I'll be honest, I didn't watch any of those TikTok videos you sent me. Like none of them. I, I just, I just hit the little reply thing and, and send heart emojis. You know, it's not because I think any of these women are attractive and I'm going to do things with them. And anyway, I'm a faithful man. You know that. <laughs> okay. I mean, you're aware that like if I wanted to, I'm, I'm not saying I would, but if I wanted to, I have plenty of opportunities, especially with how many subscribers I have, <laughs> right? 
I see at least a few of them every week. They, I just get recognized when I'm out. And you probably didn't even know that, did you? So you would never know if something happened. I'm not saying it would, but it could. And that's completely different. Come on, don't start sulking. Who's your next choice? Mm, I, I recognize him, right? That's the, uh, that's the bad guy from The Walking Dead. What's his name? Jeffrey Morgan. Yeah. I, I, yeah, I can see he's good looking, but, um, I don't know. Just didn't think you were into older men, that's all. Should I be worried? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you just called him daddy? Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. But, uh... It's perfect transition for this next one, uh, for what I chose. Hear me out. Just gonna put that one right there. Yep, uh, that's your mom. Literally a mommy. Ow! Why'd you hit me? Babe, if you look like her when you get older, I would be the happiest man on earth. She's beautiful. I'm not saying that. Babe, that was a compliment. It means that in the future, I'll still love you. I mean, I'll love you no matter what, but I mean, like, if you look this way... Well, no. Wait... <laughs> Love just it isn't a physical thing. I'm still attracted to you, no matter how you look when you grow older. I am not attracted to your mom. This was just supposed to be like, how great you'll look in the future. This is a celebration of you. It'd be like, hear me out, you in 20 years. 35? Ah, oh, she's really holding up. Ow! Ah! Oh. I knew this was like a really bad idea to play this game. And I told you that. Why are you getting so mad at me? This is, this is a trend you asked for. <sighs> okay. Oh, <laughs> the next one's your revenge? You can try. It takes a lot to get me jealous. That's... that's my best friend, Ben. Okay. <clears throat> no, nothing. I have no thoughts on it at all. I think you have good choice. It's, you know, he is caring and sweet and um, everything you'd want in a friend. So, hear me out. Claire. Why your friend Claire? I mean, okay, babe, don't get me wrong, but, um, have you seen those thighs? Last time we went to the beach, she cracked a watermelon between them. What? <laughs> That's body positivity. That's why I once told her that her thighs are amazing. It's not because I'm attracted or anything. I'm just, I'm being positive. And she shouldn't be ashamed of how she looks. Have you never heard that thick thighs save lives? Babe, your, your thighs are perfect. What are you talking about? Okay, yeah, they're not as thick, but they're perfect for me, for you. They're perfect for you. I love to lay on the couch and rest my head on your lap when we watch movies together. And you, and you do that thing where like you play with my hair. It feels like heaven. Why do you look so mad? 
I just follow the rules of this game? Okay, it's true that except for Himiko, I only picked people that we really know instead of celebrities, but, well, you know, I, I think that it's um, important to take into account the person's aura. Yeah. So I need to kind of have that connection to find something attractive. It's not that big of a deal. Babe, come on. Don't be like this. It's not like I'm really gonna get together with any of these women. Do you, do you really think I'm actually the type of man that wants to cozy up to your mom? That way? Okay, look, just because it looks that way doesn't mean that that's the truth. Hey, I'm not lying. I gave you a valid explanation for all my choices. It is not my fault if you don't believe me. You're being jealous because of your own thoughts. I didn't do anything wrong. Hold on. Where are you going? I'm sorry, coming... Ending the stream? You were streaming this? I thought you were recording it. I didn't know we were live. Yeah, of course it changes everything. Now your followers think I'm a jerk. They already do. <laughs> okay, just because I talked badly about you once. Really? Oh, God, that is unfair. And I apologized afterwards. I have been a supportive boyfriend ever since then. Where are you going now? Why do you want to see Claire? To complain about me? <laughs> All right, I know she's your friend, but the fact that you chose to go to her place is just a little bit weird after being jealous like that. Okay, okay, I'm done talking. Go do whatever you want. If it helps you calm down, be my guest. Hey, Claire? Are you sure it's the first time I've called you? <laughs> That's so weird. You know, I thought I had already done it in the past. I just got your number out of my girlfriend's phone. Anyway, how are you? Good, good, good. Glad to hear it. Look, um, yeah, I'm, I'm doing good. I just, I, I wanted to uh, call you and talk to you because something happened. Yeah. Yeah, and, and she's on her way to your place as we speak. <laughs> Actually, it's a, it's a bit of a crazy story. You probably know about this stupid hear-me-out cake trend, right? Okay, so she wanted to do this together, but first, she didn't even tell me that it was going to be on stream. And secondly, I guess I maybe misunderstood the assignment. No, I'm not calling you to warn you that she's coming, but because... Look, if, if you do happen to watch the stream later, just don't be surprised if your name gets brought up. No, I'm, I'm the one that picked you. Why? Okay, I mean, listen, if I'm being honest with you, can you promise me not to tell her? Oh, God, you're the best. So, um, maybe I thought I was supposed to pick women that um, we get to do things with. And, you know, 
me and my girlfriend and the women. Harem. Yeah, that's what it's called. Damn, and, and you know what? Now that I say it out loud, I feel really dumb for thinking that was even what she was going for. <sighs> of course, there's no way she'd ask me for this. But, you know, whatever. When I, when I realized my mistake, I thought I did good in covering it up. Like, I, I had good excuses for each person. But she still got mad at me. Yeah, like, it's my fault that this went badly. She didn't even explain it properly to me. Hmm? Uh, yeah, I mean, I did say your name, but it's like... Not in an embarrassing way, I guess. Oh, because... <laughs> Look, I think it would have been, like, really hot if... With you, um, both at the same time. <laughs> it's probably, you know, it's probably weird, right? Like, like too weird. Hmm? What? What do you mean that you agree? Wait, 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 wait. I don't care if she's ringing your door. Answer me. What do you mean by saying yes? Claire, now I want to know. <laughs>